Well, a Louisville artist and designer has been selected as the Kentucky Derby Festival's official poster artist for the 2023 season. Uh, get ready, right, to see her work everywhere this season. Liesl Long Chantrell is joining us now in the studio. Uh, talk a little bit more about this official poster. And Liesl, congratulations to you. you. What an you honor. Much, Thank you. Oh, you had to be so excited. I always like to know, like, when you got the word that you're the official poster, like, where were you and what did you do? Well, I, we live on a farm out in Crestwood. Um, I have a fa I'm a family with three little children, and so I was with them, and the Kentucky Derby Festival called me, and so I was very excited. Oh. So we all cheered around. Yes. <laughs> like the Girl Scouts, yay! Yes, we were all very excited, oh. so I was so thankful for the opportunity. Absolutely, and it's, so. it's absolutely beautiful. We have um, a picture of it we want to show right here. Oh, it's gorgeous, and I don't know. I look at that, and I just think of the happiness and the celebration immediately of the Derby Festival. Kind yes. of what, where, where was your mind kind of going into this process? Like, how did you want to come up with this concept? Yes, the Kentucky Derby is such an uplifting and energetic time of the year, and I love painting people, and so I wanted, I definitely wanted them to, they bring the life, they are the life and color of the event. So the people are very important to me. And then the sky, the Louisville skyline brings the community together. And the balloons, love balloons, celebration. Yes. Think of every, like everything, birthdays, celebration, uh, balloons. And the Pegasus create this uplifting, up, up and away sky. It so. is, it just, it, just, it just beams of positivity, right? Yes, I, I, love, love, I love color, I love vibrancy, layers. Yes, uh, and this has been, you know, a long process for you. You've been doing your art for a long time. Yes, right? ever since I was a little girl, went to DuPont Manual High School in the mm -hmm. Visual Arts Magnet. Wonderful, wonderful school that um, I got into the F Fashion Institute of Design and Merchandising wow. for college and studied textile and fashion illustration. And so have loved, just love creating, love creating and painting artwork so yeah how long did it take you to create the derby festival poster <laughs> like from did you go back and forth like start from the concept yes. and i know it's like yes. how many things were like wadded up and thrown on the floor <laughs> i was not doing that yes that is I not going to make it i start with several photos <laughs> i merge it all together and i work an hour here an hour there so, especially around kids yes with <laughs> little kiddos so creative. and they add so much energy so uh. i put that to paper and so I was very it it just takes two hours here two hours there. Right. so I like, never have the exact life? number but I always have I get very it, it's so fun seeing how the painting evolves yeah so. and with the final product is it something that you looked at and you said yep that's it this is the one when it all came together, yes, <laughs> yes. And, and um, you know, behind the scenes, um, do you like know if you're competing against other artists or like how do you know who you're up against or do you even know that there are other people in the mix? Well, the Kentucky Derby Festival contacted me. Mm -hmm. They have seen my Kentucky themes. A lot of my artwork is based around Kentucky with artbyliesel.com. Yeah. And so I, they had been following my artwork and they personally contacted and me. And they, they, they yes. single you out. Yes. Which almost, Liesl, has to be like more pressure that I am selected. <laughs> yes. <laughs> now, <laughs> now I really have to come up with something that, that they're gonna say, yes, this is why, this is why we reached out to her. Exactly, I Phenomenal. really wanted to give a painting that really connects with the viewers in Kentucky. So definitely, <laughs> I really wanted to <laughs> capture that. So yes. <laughs> definitely, where else can we see your work? You mentioned your website. Yes. And then I know if we're out shopping, I think I saw like what, your products and your merchandise, it's virtually everywhere. There, I have that you wouldn't realize that it's your work, but it's everywhere. Yes, mm -hmm. I have artwork for sale in local stores, cartwheels, paper, and gifts at Chenoweth Square in Louisville is one, and Mercantile on Main and Lagrange, but various local stores. Yes, yeah. I'm very thankful for all the all the support, especially over the years from Kentucky. But so, we are yes. so excited for you and congratulations. Well, thank you very um, much. On the poster and your success, you know, doing what you love, isn't that just the gift of all? It, it is, is being able it to is. do what you love. It's fun, it's fun to go to work. <laughs> it's fun, is. it's fun. Well, Lisa, so, thank yes. you so much. We're gonna remind everybody, the public can see the 2023 poster and the full merchandise line at Festival Unveiled, presented by Four Roses Bourbon on Thursday, March the 16th, over at the Melwood Art Center. So that's a great opportunity to kind of mingle around <laughs> 
around and get to check out everything. Tickets are on sale now and can be purchased online at kdf.org.